Hi guys, welcome back to another video, and this is my usage review of uh, One OS uh, by the One OS team. And uh, before we start the usage review, I'll just give you a few um, rundowns. Like here, there is no uh, pixel backup. I had to uh, flash else post and then do the. Pic I had to use the Pixelify module. Now I suggest everybody does this because the Google Photos. Um, really sucks without unlimited storage and if you really want the perks i suggest you definitely should use um the google pixel uh, pixel like g photos face unlock works perfectly fine and so does uh, fingerprint unlock it's uh, as, you, as you can see it's pretty fast and face unlock let's try face unlock yep face unlock also works pretty well now uh, here is where i start my usage review of the rom now before anything i know everybody gives a shit about uh, battery backup and you know who doesn't give a fuck you know like so here is the usage uh, my usage and uh, i am getting about 8 hours of battery backup uh, that is after underclocking the cpu about 25% and now it's not underclock but uh, you can imagine after underclock it i get even a better performance so um that's 8 hours and it's great because it's a mi ui rom and no other mi ui rom gives 8 hours every other mi ui rom is fucking terrible when it comes to battery uh, capacity and uh, just screen on time so that's great a huge 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 con that this is running on android 10 now i don't know if that's a deal breaker for some people but it definitely was a deal breaker for me about 2 3 months ago so android 10 and the security patch level is also from 2020 so that is something to look out for um now i have changed about 50 to 60 custom roms and the main reason i switched to this as my daily driver is because it's fucking stable it's insanely fucking stable now you have to think why we even install custom roms in the first place we want a capability to do our tasks light heavy we want a uh, a stable custom rom that doesn't have too many bugs and when we are out in the real world we don't want it to give us a uh, random uh, dumbass issues that we have to deal like i was using project elixir and i was using other custom roms i used to go to the gym and suddenly it won't just it will stop playing songs or like it, the songs my my bluetooth will just start disconnecting for no reason so there those are small annoying things that come from other custom roms that i don't see here so that's great and um, one more great thing that i got from jinto james video i almost forgot to mention it in my previous recording was the restart menu it's amazing because it's close to the power button and you get to go to the bootloader the fast boot mode and you get to give silent or uh, ring it's amazing you don't get that in many other miui roms and it doesn't have that stupid 5 second delay bug uh, and i really appreciate that now um one more great thing that comes in this is the one os space uh, you can basically install a lot of uh, g g apps and you can install a lot of mi uh, apps this is a debloated version of mi ui so it, it, there are not many um apps that are um here so if you miss some of those mi ui apps i don't know you have to be a stupid fuck to even miss them but like if you miss any mi apps then you can install them from here now another thing uh the gaming performance uh, the gaming performance is identical to a stock miui rom so that's that's not much of a problem if you want any antutu scores you could uh, you, i can uh, suggest to ashish technical services uh, miui rom videos and so as uh, sai ponamada's videos great uh, you can go and watch their antutu scores now here are uh, some major issues that i have faced here and i don't know it's not a deal breaker for me but i know that the custom uh, routing community and the custom rom community are very finicky when it comes to this stuff one major major issue is you cannot use custom kernels now that seems kind of stupid uh, it's se linux is uh, enforcing so why can't we even why can't we flash custom kernels that's because is that's because of the fact that it will overheat It's not that you can't flash custom kernels, but if you flash a custom kernel, it will start overheating. Now, uh, I know that Poco F1 is an aging beast, and 
there is no reason for us to even uh, increase its thermal capacity because that will degrade its battery and finding custom parts for this phone has become as hard as it already is so i don't suggest doing that so please uh, if you really love your uh, ngk and your rockstar and your dhg don't don't install this rom but i don't find that an issue because on uh, the stock kernel it's amazing no heating issues whatsoever it just stays a little warm but you know uh you got to do what you got to do and now here are uh, my personal thoughts about this rom i have uh, as i uh, uh, my afer mentioned um credentials i have used about 50 to 60 custom roms and i think this is the best one by far now that doesn't mean i'm going to not change i'm definitely going to review more roms and for that you guys have to drop some roms that i should review and i will 100% review them doesn't matter if they are miui roms or they are uh, stock android roms or even an old rom that you think is extremely stable i'll go ahead and review them and um a special announcement i would like to make is i am definitely giving away a mi max 2 by the end of this month it's a pretty old phone and this is not some uh, stupid fake giveaway it's a real giveaway uh, mainly because it's a rooted phone and i don't personally have a use for it and i feel like some of you uh, geeks um custom routing geeks would love to uh, play around with that phone so uh, these are my social media handles definitely go and shoot me a text follow me on there because uh, i've disabled text from random people follow me on there shoot me a text and tell me if you want the rom uh, if you want the phone and i will definitely figure out a way to give it to you and uh, same thing goes for you guys as well If you have any uh, ROMs uh, or any phones that you want me to check out, or have any old phones lying around um, that are rootable, surely give me a text and tell me that this phone I don't need anymore. This is the price I want for it, or I'm giving away, uh, giving it away for free. I would love to have those phones. Uh, I will uh, look forward to the proceedings as well. So no worries on that. And yeah, that's pretty much it. And um, I'll see you guys next time. Uh, with a new rom and uh, hopefully a better rom than this one because this is a great rom and i would love to see something even outperform this so um uh, that's it guys uh, this is the trick rishi menon signing out peace out bye